Hello, my name is Carl Surrey and this is a video tutorial for the Facebook group called Fans of Serif Software. Now this is only be a fairly short video because it is just showing you a quick tip which I have just sort of learnt myself. And it is about extending the canvas size. Now I the video before this in Affinity Photo I made an image where I needed to ex increase the size of the canvas to flip the image to make a reflection because I was doing a video on making a false water and reflection. And what I had to do was to, I mean, I made a duplicate of the layer and then I highlighted the background layer and then I had to use document, resize and then I had to work out the, the size and change the size to get the extra canvas size that I needed. So let me just zoom out and what I, I found I could have done is use the crop tool. If I click on the crop tool here, at the top here you can see the size that the image is. So it's 3648 by 1704 and it is a 1704 size that I wanted to change for the image that I was using and what I needed to do was to double that size so it made it 3, 4, 1, 4. I'm using the crop tool if I click and hold this middle anchor point and if you look at the size at the top you can see that it's changing so if I come down to 3, 4, 1, 4 or as close as I can get it as long as it's not over it's not going to be as precise as changing the document size. Three, four, there you go. Three, four, one, eleven. I got to. Let me just. That'll do. Three, four. Yes, yeah, so it's, it's only a couple of pixels out, and then when you click apply, you now have that extended canvas. So what you could have done would then highlight the top. Click the move tool, drag that down, and that pretty much would have been the start the starting point to make the reflection image. So I hope that will help. Anybody who might be struggling with changing the document size, I mean obviously you could have I could have moved it you know to the left or right to extend width ways as well as height wise. Which is a, quite a neat trick if you just want to extend the canvas to do something like this, like flipping the image. So I hope that helps somebody. Thank you for watching and goodbye.